again. Thank you for tuning in to another pretty exclusive podcast. Another episode, another Wednesday. Wait, why is it doing this? I'm sorry, y'all. We always late, but <laughs> I mean, can you hear me now? Maybe I can't have it so low. I guess I'm tall. Hello, everyone. Y'all thought I won't hear this. We y'all about to log off, won't y'all? Girl, cut it out. <laughs> Don't start. Well, thank you for tuning in. For those just joining, this is another week of pretty exclusive content. Hold another on, hold on, Wednesday. Let me turn this off. Um, oh. Sorry. Another All right. Wednesday hump day. Everybody's getting through that work week. If you work, if you don't, every day is the weekend. Anyway. So make sure y'all go to our Instagram. Pretty exclusive content. Uh, please follow our Instagram, go to our YouTube page. And what is they supposed to do? Like, comment, <laughs> and subscribe. <laughs> Today. And um, tonight's live. I'm going to go live. Well, I'm already live, but I'm not going to have it on my page. You're just going to have to go to our YouTube page to see the actual podcast. Um, we do have special guests joining us tonight. Um, it's Beach Boy Tay and LV from the beach, right? YBN. YBN LV. LV. So, um, y'all want to get started? Yep. So, y'all had a good day at work today. No. Oh my god. It was hectic. Hard today. No. It was we good. Hard no. today, Busy baby. is good. It, that's why we're late. We were at, it's all the time. But so. you know, since time went back, it's a little what? The day seems a lot longer. It takes forever. I'm so just ready the for time went over. slow, but we I thought today was a good day at work. Did you? Well, I'm late because I had to get gas. Um <laughs> I like to drive zero miles to empty, so Yeah, that's you do. I had to get gas so I wasn't gonna make it. Here. Well, we're glad you're here. Yeah. Yes. So that's so, why I'm late. Before our guests get here, we're going to talk about a topic that is becoming more popular. Um, I guess I'll say with our generation. What with topic is that? Polygamy. <laughs> she wouldn't talk about polygamy today. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about it. Okay. So polygamy is... Typically, when a male is in a relationship with more than one wife or girlfriend. Let's see. Let me pull it up while you discuss it. Go ahead. <laughs> what? You, you, Go ahead. Let me, what's you your know definition what it is. of it? I just say it's typically for men because men act like if they're in a polygamous relationship with a female, then that means they're gay, so they shy away from it. Could y'all have a... I could have a... I could, uh, I could have... No. You could what? Mm -mm. I would have to choose my women guys, women women though. Women. You could oh, you, you mean you could be in a polygamous relationship with more than one, one, yeah. one male? Yeah, um, I, I have to choose my guys, and we, we could be a family. Yeah, <laughs> we all a family. We ha I have days where, you know, I I, we go on our dates, and it'll be a schedule. No. It'll be organized. It's not for me. Like savages. I it's, mean, I could. I wouldn't. Oh, Not in this life, but in a fantasy where I would love to do Oh, it. look at my shirt. <laughs> Savage. See, yeah. No. I'm saying. But in the movie, you didn't feel like they loved each other more than they in loved the her? Yeah, Savages. She, she did say that. I've never seen it. What? you never seen it? Well, everybody who has not seen it, please watch it tonight. What is it? Where can we find this movie? <laughs> Do you have cable? I don't know. You got <laughs> Is it on demand? Is it on? I don't know. I watched it when it came cable? out. I mean, I don't okay, know. Okay, so it it's should the be on demand. Or a custom of having more than one wife or husband at the same time. I just said it. Could you be more Hell than one? No. Could you be a sister Hell wife? Hell no. Mm -mm -mm. Hell even, okay, no. Even if it, it wasn't a guy that you were in love with first, but you were, you know, out no. here, you didn't have any kids. And no. I'm going to tell you why. Let me think because if you in, in, um, not in love with him, right? Tell him the topic. Polygamy is the topic. But if you're not in love with him, you're going to want to date other people. He's not going to want you to date other people. So you sitting in an emotionless relationship, and he got multiple females for what? You know, I just feel like polygamy and pimping mm -hmm. is the same thing. You got all these hoes. And <laughs> so. so you couldn't be a sister wife? No, I wouldn't be a sister wife. 
You could. I mean, like in a fantasy world, yeah. I mean, no, like, we talking about in real life. Like Nothing we talk about is fantasy world. You know that. Yeah. Yep. You lie. What? We supposed to be honest on it's, this podcast. And I, you're I'm lying. being as honest as it's honest nice. could be. Like I'm telling you, I could, but it wouldn't. I, it wouldn't be me and him starting it. It'd be me, you know, him starting a new one and me agreeing to be one of the wives. I would be the first wife. I would have to be important, but I I wouldn't mind. But important. You probably feel like, well, I'm the first wife, but why you want to go to this this? Because it, it was an agreement. But, but how I'm does that make you more it. important than the other wife? Because like, she first. still get the same same benefits you get. Maybe not so. We don't know because we're not in those relationships. We don't know if somebody reaps the benefits more than the other one. I think it's levels in there. You think so? I think I so. Saw, I mean, I used to watch Sister Wives on. Um, TLC. Right, they live in the same house. They live in the same house. Like, Everybody just have their own role. That's what, I'm what they do. Like if I was so older, you, would, you wouldn't care. You just had a master bedroom. Like say if I was an older <laughs> woman and stuff, sleeping you know. in there by yourself while he in the second bedroom. No, with his but wife it would now. have to be special. Like he would have to have a lot of money. It would have to be a mansion. Everybody is living happy. Like so, y'all couldn't be a part of uh, Hugh Hefner's Playboy Mansion. No, y'all couldn't have lived there. You. First of all, you know, I watch documentaries all the time, and none of them were happy. Like, none of them were happy. They had a curfew. They had to be in the house by 9 o'clock. But if you were that age, if you were young, no, and you ain't had no kids, y'all no. wouldn't do that? So no. You I, would did well I don't want to be in a room with my monkey while you... So you wouldn't no. have a flavor of love? No. 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 I just said he had to be rich. Flavor? <laughs> <laughs> So if he was rich, then you could be on a show like that. Like if it was if it was Hugh Hefner, I could be on a show like that. I'm not going so on Bachelor and shit Hugh? like that. Hugh Hefner, if I was like 19, yeah, I would date Hugh Hefner. Yes. Hell, Hell no. Oh, put me in the age, house. Let me design age. my room. Give me a curfew because I'm good. I'm living in Hugh Hefner's house. I'm a bunny. And you know, what are the perks to that? Like they have perks. What? I don't know them. They I'm have parties where all of these fine athletes come to the party and you can't talk to nobody because you in here with Hugh Hefner. Well, no, thank maybe. you. Right. No, thank you. Well, for me, I, mean, I can yeah, do it. To each his own. I don't, I mean, I don't. That's on you. On here, right. Mm-mm. It's not for me. I don't care me. if you judge me or not. My I'm temper going. is too bad. If I, I want to like, go on a date. I'll see y'all next year, two <laughs> years. Go. I'll invite y'all to the I parties. I will invite y'all to all the big parties, but I'm going. Yeah, no. I'm getting on the bus. I, I, no. Take him on for the team. Thank you. I appreciate so you. What about having like that's like having two husbands? Like would you, you said you would. She said she could. Husbands. I wouldn't. Neither. First of all, I get tired too. Well, you don't have to d- make it sexual like all the time, you know. No, what you mean? Saying, you gonna have you to got two people husband. that you got to fulfill their needs. But I'm the boss in this relationship. No, you're I not. Take, you, you ever read about that lady who had all them men? Yes. And she, but they loved her. She That don't mean she, she was, was the boss. She put roots on them or something because <laughs> it was, it's a that real story. That don't mean story. she was the boss, though. If y'all come to but she the boss. She started that. They carried her on a, a carpet and stuff. I'm telling They're you. They're weird. I'm going to show you. So if you met a guy, right? And y'all fell in love. And he came to you like, you know, you can get another husband, whatever you want to do. Like, I'm cool with that. You would, be, you would, you wouldn't feel away. I'm gonna think he's a clown. Right. Yeah. No, I would. I have to be the. I have to be on a search for that. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying I'm not. So what I'm saying is, how I could would you get it. to that point though? Like, I could be like 65, 70, or whatever, and. Um, 65, 70. You know, looking for love. Man, I'm bored. Life, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I'm 65, I wouldn't 70. engage with the other woman. No, we saying if you have two two men. Right, like you wouldn't husband. feel weird if your dude came to you like, you know, you could have another nigga if you want nah, to. No, I would have to I would have to be the person behind it. It had to be my idea. If he says it to me, yeah, I'm not going to agree with that. So even uh, if it's your if idea, I, if, you, if, I, if you... If it's t- my idea. Okay, so say you take it to him and you like, you know, I just feel like I need one other dude to complete me. And he like, oh, I'm cool with that. You st- you wouldn't feel away? Because I would feel no, away. No, I got mind control. I'm be like, what's wrong with you? I got mind like, control. What's so what's so why? I know why he doing it. Because... I'm in a charge. bitch. Yeah, you my bitch. I don't oh, want no okay. nigga that's a bitch. He ain't at a all, bitch period. to y'all. He a bitch to me. He a bitch. I don't want that. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. That won't work for me at all. Man, yeah, I'm 
gonna stick beside like her. You gonna stick beside her? Having this discussion. So. Yeah. Yeah. Let me let me just tell y'all y'all just tell me. So tonight we left our jar. So this is off the top. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you know, we don't have this our is... jar, so we're not pulling from the jar tonight like we normally do. Cause um, mm, somebody left our topics. Mm. But hey, Wani. Karina says, this is Tara Real Personality, y'all. She's super funny. I love her. Hey, girl. Y'all hey, Wani. If y'all joining our live, comment now. See, we I know Wani agrees with me, right? <laughs> Wani, tell her you don't date no bitches. Tell her you do not date bitches. We ain't talking about date. Oh, you talking saying about bitch like niggas. Bitch niggas, yeah. But I'm saying if 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 she wanted to do it, she would be the one the that control like I The type of men that am. you date. You know they're not, not going to go for it. with them. I'm not seeing. So then how would you get to that, though? You I don't just go outside your box? Be, I would be older. You know, if, if it, I'm just saying I, I would do it. I'm not saying I would do it. I'm just saying Wait, what? I would do it. Wait, what? I'm not saying I would do it. So I'm interested in doing it. I'm saying I could probably do it if it was not somebody I love. We just met and we came to terms that this is what we wanted to be. Hell, I might get old and, you know, get bored. With some sister wives or two husbands or something. But you never know what life takes you. I know it ain't taking me there. I can guarantee you that. Y'all yeah. gonna see me on what's the um I, I, I what's the like shows sharing. we watch? Hey Mike. What's the shows we watch where the women be killing their um dudes? Oh, fatal wow. attraction. Fatal attraction. They be Everybody killing. in the house no. dead. Alright, yeah, so hold on. So if y'all just joining, um we are waiting for our guests to arrive. Um, I'm gonna give y'all some time. Y'all give us a topic y'all wanna hear us talk about. <laughs> Wanda said remove that patrol now. <laughs> no, let me take, let me take a sip. The All right. person to comment a topic, that's what we discussing tonight. I'm trying to drink out of two straws, it ain't working. Cause you got two tanks. Anybody gave us a topic? The world doesn't understand that joke, okay? <sighs> you are so sensitive. I don't have time. But you could, you could have multiple do you Relationships see, going on, girl, please. I'm just saying, like, um, what? In my 80s, God dang. Hey, hey, Rhonda. Okay, let me shout in out. In your 80s? You better be glad if your um, husband's hey, still Rhonda, living in your hey, 80s. Hey, what you mean? Hey, you have a young Kaka. husband. Baby. Hey, to. Oh, my niece is up here. Hey, hey. hey. Oh, Kearney. <laughs> your homework better be done. Girl, don't put her on blast. And can you? If y'all have any discussion, any topic that y'all want to... Hey, Pooty, my brother's up here. Let me look hey, at... My, hey, the mom, pretty mom, exclusive mom, content. Hey, hey, mom. Hey, mother. No, go ahead and drop the heat so we can put you on the show. All right, so... Somebody said, do you feel like Taraji on Acrimony was wrong and how she acted? Ooh, she went crazy. Hmm... <sighs> Yes. I do. I do, too. I do. I do, yeah, too. she was wrong. Yeah, she was. She was. Even though I can understand where she's coming from, she still was wrong. No. I felt like she let her sisters be too involved in their relationship way from the beginning. Mm-hmm. And I'm trying to remember the move for real because I only saw it well, one remember, time. Well, remember, she, okay, so she was down. She had the money. Right. He was trying to, you know, build up his. I remember that. Yeah, his business. Mm-hmm. So she felt like she gave him all this money and then he just went to live this life with this female. But mm-hmm. she was pretty much like bashing him. Right, like she didn't believe in it for real. But he paid her back. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like he paid her and back. And I feel like the reason why she didn't believe in him was because her sisters were so involved in their relationship. Like. From what I saw in the beginning, it was like she would have rolled it out with him had her sisters not been so influential in how she felt about stuff. Because we don't get in each other's personal, like, yeah. no, I don't care. I mean, I'm not going to say I don't care, business. but it's not my business. First of all, let me tell y'all. As I long as you ain't getting nothing if you buck or not. <laughs> I'm not getting in it. First of all, I don't get in, I don't give relationship advice because I am single. So I don't, I'm not, no, I'm never that girl. No, no, no. Mm-mm, not, mm-mm. I'm good. You good? You happy? Okay. Somebody said that's what happened when you listen to lonely women. The sisters weren't lonely, though. They had they husbands. They had husbands. That was very the sisters active. had husbands. They, were they just active. didn't like him for their sister. They weren't lonely. Yeah, like, so how do y'all feel about family? Because family will get in your business. You um, got you got to shut it down. 
Right. You gotta shut it down. It's yeah. boundaries. Right. It's boundaries. And as long as you know that I'm good, like yeah. I'm not the person. As long as ain't beating your ass every day. He not taking my check, taking my money. Or blatantly like if I mean let me be hundred percent honest since that's what we do on this show. If I have very few people that I'm going to interject myself in a relationship if I see something. You, Jay, Ross, that's about it. If I see something, I'm going to tell you, like, this is what I saw. However you handle it is how you handle it. If you choose right. to work it out, you choose to work it out, but I'm going to let you know. But at the same time, so I can't say I'm not going to intervene in your relationship because I would if something comes to me, but at the same time, I'm not going to be in your ear like, right. why are you going to still mess with him? You need to leave him alone. You could do this and do that. Like, no. Yeah, and um, that, that's crazy because Kia said we should discuss if you caught your friend nigga cheating, would you tell her? <laughs> and I was like, honestly, I would tell her, but if I got to keep telling you, I'm not going to keep telling you because, yeah. you know what I'm saying? At yeah. that point, it's like, all right, bro, you ain't going to leave him. And then if you tell him I told you, oh, I mean, that's you it for him, you. but don't, t- you know, rule number one, don't Mm-mm. tell who told you something. Mm-mm. First of all, you can't tell the dude you mess with what your friends or sisters or whoever have told mm-hmm. you because they still got to interact. They still got to be around each other. That's the cardinal rule number one. Unless you know for a fact you're going to leave him alone and he lying like, I didn't do this, and it's like, no, I know you did it because such and such told me. And that's going to be the end of your relationship, different story. But if you know you're going to be back with him, it's no point to disclose where it came from, <laughs> one. Then I think I've had friends get mad at me that's why I don't tell people stuff unless it's y'all. Because I've had friends get mad because you told them something. Mm-mm. No. Or like, Thank you. we'll try to argue down, like, that's a lie. You ain't see that. This, that, and third. Like, so if it's not y'all, I don't tell nobody nothing. Cheat in peace. Don't, if you see me somewhere and you cheating, you don't got to worry about nobody finding out unless you mess with one of my sisters. Yeah. Pretty much. So. Okay, next topic, who's up there? Any questions on y'all? Y'all know I'm so I'm just reading some of these comments. Mm-hmm. Y'all seem a little dry today. What's up with y'all? Oh, that's you over here. Oh, baby, I'm never dry. I'm the life of the party. If y'all know me, whenever we go out, they, don't, they go out without me, they don't have fun. That's a whole lie. <laughs> Look at her. That's a whole lie. They don't have fun when I'm not in the club, okay? Girl. But when I go out, we have the best time. <laughs> I can't believe you sitting here saying that. And me well, and number been one is honesty. Me and you have been going out more lately, so I can't even believe you saying that. And, and do we have a good time with me? Yeah, and we have a good time. We had a ball that night. Just, now. Let me tell y'all, when that man slipped out his shit. Oh, <laughs> that was a long time ago. Oh, gosh. That no, was not. That was like a month ago. Okay, oh. y'all keep acting like y'all be going out. You mad because you don't go? <laughs> yeah, this is a relationship right here. So, <laughs> when you know, Bonnie said, time. when I see a nigga doing something, I would tap him on the shoulder so he ain't got to guess who told. That's real bitch shit, though. Yeah. That's real bitch shit. I'm but very bitch don't move sure. like that. Yeah. But nowadays, you got to be careful, though, because a nigga, nowadays, y'all know how these guys doing females. But my thing is, I don't like to be, I don't like to see my friend all fucked up. Hurt. I don't hurt. like to see them hurt and shit, so... You know, if if I see it, it got to really be I see it. Like, it can't be no bullshit. But see, me, I... I like, I can't jump to conclusions. If but you know me, I'm not going to jump to a conclusion. If I know this your dude and I see him somewhere with a female, I'm going to go up to him. What's going yeah. on? Who is this? What's they up? They're going to already know they're in trouble when they see us anyway. Yeah, so, like... So, you better call an answer. Yeah, you might as well go ahead because I'm about to FaceTime him. Pretty much. <laughs> they can do that a lot. Or oh, I'm going to text, like, come pull up. I mean, they do it too, though. Niggas yeah, do it niggas too. Yeah, niggas will do that too. They'll do it too. A nigga DM, you messing with a nigga, bitch or something, they'll DM you too. My yeah. homeboy uh, sent me a video with Tory Lanez That's saying, about to say that. Mike sent me a video with Tory Lanez. I said, you know what? This is what niggas do for real. Yeah, so, that's yeah. what they do. Because niggas nowadays, they tell... They run. They they talk more than females. I was about to say they worse than females. They would tell. Okay, they would tell a female though. I saw your nigga with such and such. Or they would tell you I saw such and such with such and such. Yeah, they know each other. Or the famous line. 
You fuck with him. Damn, he got all the bitches. Like, like oh, damn, I thought he was supposed to be. Yeah. Yeah, it's like. Yeah. And I, I honestly, I don't respect the nigga that do that. Like, I hate a talking nigga. Like, yeah. I, I don't like it. Don't. That's let let, let me tell you what I don't report. I don't report. If I see one of my homeboys, like, like, like I got a lot of homeboys. Yeah. Now, if well, I, I see one of their bitches out uh, cheating, I ain't yeah. talking about that. I don't tell on no females, other females. I don't go back and tell that nigga. I can I hang with your nobody. nigga every day. Yeah. And I'm still not going to tell him what you're doing. Because you know why? Bitches been getting shooting on for so long. <laughs> I'm like, you go ahead on, bitch. And nine times out of ten, your nigga probably cheating anyway. So right. you go ahead on, bitch. I ain't telling. And I, I'm not saying that because it's like that's some of, a lot of guys don't like summer walk. I've all. seen a lot of females who say they're not in that space of their life, or they're not going through. You know, I'm not in that space of my life either. But that's good music. Yeah. Like it's I know, relatable you know, some point. At I, some I, point. I, I, yeah. I used to could relate to it. You get yeah, what I'm saying? At some point, yeah. it's relatable. So it's like a lot of guys they they get mad. Why they get mad? They get mad. They women. They women like they, they act like, like females. That's what you want to date for your whole life and be relationship. <laughs> no, see, you going too far. I'm, I'm just not saying. going too far. If you got bitch, I ain't problems, saying I want to do it now. I'm, I'm not saying, saying I'm gonna ever do it. I'm just saying y'all ask for that. Leave that alone. We was talking I mean, about and I'm some not, walk. Y'all, let's not. We not gonna be. Male but no, we're not male dashers, but the proof is really in the pudding. They are very feminine. Sorry for, we're not talking about you. <laughs> okay, well, we thought about it last week, so let's change the subject. What? Well, about maybe men being feminine, yeah. That was our last week. We could talk about that every week. Right, because I don't it get worse. So, what y'all think about, okay, every every guys, week, every all the guys right. up here, I want y'all to say, what y'all think about females that act hard, act like niggas? What y'all looking at me for? Wait, I don't. We wait, just wait, evolved. Wait, 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 wait. Evolution. You evolved oh, to your environment. Did you look at me? We. Why you being weird to me? Why you being weird to me? I don't have no microphone. I got braids in my voice. Nah, you weird. They hogging it. Go ahead. I don't even want to. Put your phone right here. You want it when we pull it out? Preferably, but never mind now. Oh no, we don't talk about this. It's right here. What? If y'all don't get loud, thank y'all. Can y'all hear Sherry? Because, I mean, I y'all can't hear Sherry. Y'all can hear Sherry. Make them want the mic. So, hold on. So, you said. I, what? I don't act like, you know, because I'm offended. Why? Because I don't act like a, a nigga, though. Like, the alpha male not taking the hard woman serious. Mr. Take them to church. He said alpha male, what? Not yeah. taking a hard woman serious. Oh, what? Okay. So what classifies a woman as being hard though? Right. Is it? Yeah. Because it's a fine line between independent like and hard. Y'all can call an independent woman hard. Right. So, so what, what classifies that? Like hard. what classifies as hard or acting like a nigga? What Let me tell you. Guys, I'm out of peace coming. I'm soft and submissive and hard. And I'm very. Ooh, I'm very soft. I'm very mushy oh, and stuff God. like that. I'm very. Huh. Flirty, make everyone <laughs> you feel, feel like special. I'm look, this, so I know I ain't love so Right. I will be there. <laughs> Go ahead. Say, it. say the poem. <laughs> <laughs> On another episode. <laughs> but so okay. When you don't take shit, they say you acting like a nigga. That's facts. Or when now you uh, facts. when you nonchalant. That's facts. When fact. you don't care about, you don't question, you don't blow them up. That's when. It becomes you a nigga. Right, and you're not. You're just not pressed. So, you're just too old for it at some point. Mr. Take them to church said, when you don't, when you're not submissive, that's being hard. But submissiveness doesn't come. That's a reward. And that doesn't come initially. Like, right. you can't just walk into something being submissive. Like, men don't understand. They have to prove that they worthy of somebody being submissive that's to them. That's a reward, right? right. It's, it's a reward. Like, you can't just. You can't give everybody that You trouble. be too submissive, you're going to be an ice skating rink. They're going to be skating all over your ass. They're going to walk you like a dog. <laughs> Ain't no fool like an old fool. I'm okay. too old for the bullshit. I already know what y'all about. I already know what time it is, what day and age we are. You can't right. choose when you want to be submissive, so though. That That's makes me problem. hard. You That's absolutely can choose. And yeah, who said that? You was Mr. Taking the Church. Y'all go ahead and take me to his page. <laughs> <laughs> you say that? 
Yeah, you yeah. can't choose. What did he say? You he can't. He said choose. you can't choose when you want to be submissive, though. You absolutely can choose when you want to be submissive. Absolutely. You know you what? Absolutely. You, can we choose need you up here for a debate, right? Yeah. I'm gonna chop you down because this is the motherfucking great debaters right here. I'm gonna chop you down. But let me say this though: he's married. So in a marriage, oh, okay. you but that's what she's choose supposed to, to have. Be no, because you're marriage. married. Right. We're talking about dating. Yeah, dating. in this generation, right. and you married yeah. her because no, she was yeah. In, right. in a marriage, you are to be submissive. That's why right. your all. husband is doing what he's supposed to do. Is him. being the man that right. you need him to be. Then right. Of course, you would uh, be submissive to him and give him everything that he giving you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, because I'm, I'm, because y'all not reading all the comments. Let me go. So Mike say. We don't want a woman acting like young MA. Well, we know that. <laughs> I don't want you to date no woman acting right. like young MA. I'm going right. to get you crazy. Right. One, they basically saying when you can dish it out, but when they, they can't take when you dishing it out. That's basically what she's saying. You know, that one is that like us. You know, one is real. She always, she thinks like us. Just talk about, yeah, y'all right. I came in on the wrong time. I don't want no smoke. <laughs> <Look. laughs> Look, but like my, you say young MA. Uh, no, y'all can tell me on my Instagram too. What y'all First think about you can't hard even put, women? You can't even women put that young MA in this category because she wants somebody to be submissive to her. So you can't. You put can't put, put that a, 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 a. You can't. I don't want to be right, right, but, but you, you can't, can't put, put her in that category. Like, no, you just can't. No, and she, I don't think she goes in the LBGT. Yeah, I want some guys too. to define what what a woman acting hard is. Because right. I had a guy one time say, oh, you curse too much. I'm going to curse. That's a freedom of That's expression. Me. It helps me feel good. It gets it off my chest. It, it lets you know exactly down. where I'm coming from. So what I told him was, well, you can curse your motherfucking ass. <laughs> Bitch. Is that enough curse to fuck you? Right. So. This is what I want to know. What does being submissive mean to men, too? Because some men think being submissive means you listen to everything they say oh, and... Yeah. Doing whatever they want to do. But I want to know, though, because they don't define it. They just make it seem like if you got your own opinion about something, you're not being submissive. Well, you know, I know what submissive is. I said right. for men. And for men, she's saying you're not a man. I'm saying you're not a man. <laughs> you know what submissive is. If y'all right. wouldn't have cut me short, you would have heard. Let me finish what I had to say. Go ahead, girl. Nope, because I don't even have a microphone. Oh, we do the follow-up. Oh, I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. It's a seat over here if you want a mic. Like, what I, do I'm men have to prove to get submissive? So define, okay, steady to done. Define what submissive is to you. A woman being submissive, what is it? Hey, Clayton. So what I a man has, has to, to do to be, from for me to get to be submissive to him, what I need from a man is for me to feel love, for him to show me that he's able to Love me the way I need to be this loved. This is the same thing as nourish me. We ain't gonna do that again. Um, just, but we we answered his question. No, right? he didn't answer. What did he say? What do we need oh, for no, a man? What do we need? He from said, a man? I assume that a man have to provide and protect from jump. Why would he do that if a woman is not being feminine and submissive? So fem- let's talk about being feminine. But feminine is, I'm feminine shit. You I don't be- know how that problem. You could be feminine without being submissive, and you could be submissive without being feminine. feminine. That's right. true. And let's be honest. I'm just going to tell y'all guys straight up. If she's not submissive to you, then you're not the one. Or you doing something wrong. Right. So let's not, you know. I make you feel like I'm submissive to a certain degree. I just make you feel special. Okay, he said a woman being submissive to me is not fighting against me, but with me. Okay, now if, if that's then I'm very submissive because I'm always gonna ride with mine. Right. Yeah, even so, when you're wrong. Yeah, and I'm gonna tell you when we get home that you're wrong. Right. But it's still it's a gray area because not fighting against you with what though? Like I said, if you got a different opinion about something, they'll take that as you're not submissive. Mm-hmm. So. Yeah, so I don't think they're together. Oh. Hey, Bree. Okay, if you're just joining. The problem is. Hey, you're crazy. Were well, you the at the night coming? Most black people didn't have an example of a man who did what was needed to be submissive. So, consequently, we didn't see what a submissive woman looks like. That right, may be true for some, but I was raised by my father, so mm-hmm. I can't agree with that. But that might be true for some people, or majority of people. I'm not sure. I'm not that may very well be true. 
I get the microphone, a or people Girl, dealt see. with their mom being the breadwinner, and it's hard to have that balance. But you, the breadwinner, is you submitting to somebody. When you're going 50 50. You don't have it. Okay, the problem is most black people don't oh, have it. Oh, sorry. Jimmy yeah. Jump, you all right. And that's just there. We got a three point session tonight. You got the, um, the battle raffle with us tonight. Hi. 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 Oh, yeah, I seen them on we Instagram. Got, yeah, we seen your videos. So we got our special guests are finally here. Yeah, I got are they late? They late. They are so late. We got no, we don't have water. Okay, we got the other chair. You can drink some of this water. Hey, LV. Hey, okay. We're going to let him freestyle at the end. You want to freestyle? You want to let him freestyle at the end. I want some trouble. Go ahead. Oh, oh, never mind. We just getting started. We up and coming. So look. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. 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 Yeah, that's what I'm talking about.
Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's about it. So um, I'm still trying to get my ground back now. What y'all got to do to get it back? Man, them grounds gone. They go. Them grounds what you gone. mean? What do people mean when they go? What is they like in the you stash? Can get, you can get your gram hacked or Instagram can take it. You can get it back, but I think the Instagram is gone. My shit been going since August 10th. Mm. But you got a nice following on the new one too, right? Man, it ain't nothing compared to my old one. So let me ask y'all something. What motive? Cause I know I saw. I think it was Suki. Her friend got deleted, and she was like, you know, she felt like giving up. But then when it came back up, she was motivated. So what's motivating y'all right now? Mm. We that's just, our, that's our career. It's we, real. It's real life. That's, that's what our job is. So we just we just, we just lit. Like right, we just lit. So. People don't want to follow anything we do anyway. Y'all see, y'all just turn the city up. Yeah, real life match out. I don't match out in that long. There ain't be no difference. Well, let me ask y'all this, though, because I really wanted to ask this question. Since seeing Kanye had took uh, <laughs> Soulja Boy off the, off the song because he oh, said yeah. Soulja Boy versus what? Have y'all ever took one of y'all homeboys off y'all song and didn't tell him? Or anybody especially a homeboy. Not did not didn't tell him, but you will tell. I tell him I take him off. Or yeah. I mean, it's it's business. I'm not just about to keep you up there if your verse back just because you're my friend, or just got this our profession. So if we about to put it out, we put it out right. Keep it real with each other when you're in the studio. You know, we didn't tell you like, that verse. That ain't it. It ain't it. Like it had been times I even felt like my verse, and I might take take or do it by yourself. So, but if not, if people that right. I don't like, that I'm not tight with, ain't in my circle. Yeah, I think I just took it off and saw today. Like, you know, man, even if you in the circle, if it don't sound right, but you're coming off, I ain't even telling nobody. So what? So, so have y'all ever wrote for anybody local artists around here? Those aren't like y'all don't have to say who it is, but have y'all ever? I have. I helped start like a studio. I helped start like a studio. Was they bad? Like, didn't really know what they was doing, or they just needed up? They was. Well, nah, when I did it, um, no, nah, I, I really did. I had one person, they really want, they ain't really want into the music, but they just wanted to drop a song. But I want, I'll do too, but I'm gonna write my own. Nah, I don't. Just one time. I wrote a song for a girl. And then, like, I mean, all of us, all of us begin help. We don't write for each other, but like, we punch in in the studio, but a nigga be like, nah, don't say that, say this, yeah. or do this, it sound better. That's neat. It's like at the same time. Yeah, that's don't really, don't really write. Yeah, that's so, cool. let me ask you, oh, you, you just song for the girl, did she yeah. deliver it the way you wanted her to? That's a new age. Um, it wasn't necessarily delivering it the way she wanted me to. I wanted her to because she paid me to write, to write it for her, but, oh, okay. I mean, she like a, she like a dance and stuff, so, and she already talking nasty and shit, so the way she, she got the look and stuff. Nah, the way she was rapping is like she already knew what the hell yeah. I mean, she was doing. She has the delivery. Right? Yeah, she can, yeah. I don't so know. Let me ask y'all. Have y'all ever been removed from a song? No. Not that no more. Yeah. Well, wow. Yeah. Well, what about that top five uh, list I've seen? Top five. Top 25. Top 25. Was, um, it, was it local VA artists? Um, no, nah, not all. All of them not local, but I mean, it, well, I can't say if it's accurate or not because that's somebody's we'll opinion. From around here. It's somebody's opinion, so we can make our list. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, so someone else made that. Yeah. List. Okay, but so the person who made the person list. who made the list is like in the position Official. to to, to make, the make list. not yeah. I mean yeah mm -hmm. to make the list and make somebody get on mm -hmm. kind yeah. of sort of. But it was a dope list. So name y'all top mm -hmm. three. I got a local. Right. No, um, no, like bass, no, not. But I, I, when we did this, when they was trying to uh, tell us name our top, are you just talking about songs or are you just talking about all around package? All around, all around package. Top three. Top three, top three, top three. Crazy. Gotta put crazy on. Um, at this point right now, Flame Blazing. Oh, yeah, Flame Blazing. The third one. Because it gotta be somebody that move that. around. You can't just be sitting here. I mean, you can be saying maybe they just oh, ain't got you, on yet. And you can put your stuff in there. I mean, I can, but I ain't been doing nothing lately. So I, I ain't the type that's just gonna throw me up there because I, I, I'm nice as a bitch, though, but I, I can't do that. It's, I, it's only two I can name right now. Flame and crazy. Yeah, I already look at So you got a third one? I put, nah, I put crazy. I just put in crazy. I already look at 
No, but I feel like he did the most. He had the most going on musically. Ah, that's how I feel. So, like, where y'all want to take it? Hmm? Where y'all want to take your careers? How far y'all want to go? What, what, what's your happiness? Seeing figures off of that, seeing money. That's the ultimate goal. I for real, for real, I'm, nah, I do music though, cause I'm like, even like, I ain't even drop no tape. You gotta say it, go ahead. Alright, I'm gonna keep that one. We get, you are fire. We, get around, we get around celebrities like here or like we'll be in Cali or something, and we don't talk about no music. When we get around them, all we wanna do is shoot dice with them. Yeah. I'd rather shoot dice with you and build a relationship with you, take yeah. money, and then do a feature with you. Yeah, you, you build in some type of relationship, and it's not awkward in the studio. Let me ask you this. Is it a retirement age or is it an age where somebody is too old to get into the game? No, I don't think so no more. Because you make music for all ages. Like 30 something. Yeah. yeah. Two chains old to sell too. Yeah. Because yeah. he had to ages. change his name to get hot. Because when he was Titty Boy, I did not like him. I just then tough it, Titty Boy. But, but I see, I was not a bad like boy, he was Titty Boy. No, Double Bad Boy. Was made me start listening yeah. to him and then he disappeared and he came back as two chains yeah. and then he just been straight fired. Since I sometimes don't agree you have with to people that like, change. Like I'm the type of person I'm not gonna I can't just put my last on right now. Like, I gotta have something else going on. Well y'all do y'all got gotcha. your education. So is it a retirement age for you? I mean, if it's something you love to do, you it's a, yeah, yeah. Right. I'm just saying for you. Um, Vino say y'all just mud babies. 100, mud babies, Vino, no, I'm you know. A, I'm old school, so it's a retirement age for you. Old school. No, I know, man. I could have been an R.I.T. all the time. I know how music when I hear it. I know when it's still like retirement. So have y'all ever told anybody that trash? Yeah. Oh, yeah, back to that question you just said. I kind of get what you're saying now. It's no retirement if you're already in the game, but I'm not about to be 37, 38, 36, trying to get on. Right. Yeah, yeah, I've been to have some businesses and right. shit. Right. I ain't about to not right. give it up. Well, I put my money into somebody else that I think good. Right. But, um, yeah, what, what you say? What you trying to say? No, I was he said yeah, that he not going to be 40 and still rapping. And I said I that's said, a retirement age. He so said. So you think it should be a retirement age? I mean, I'm not a rapper. What about so, music in general? I no, no, I don't think so. Cause they only give, no, they only give, they, they only give, they only give a retirement age to rap. So you want to look at it, look down, yeah, man. Uh, yeah, because same thing. Now, rock now stars, let me if say, he was established stars. with it, no. But right. if he was trying to get into it, and yes. we don't have nothing because he's still trying to get but into some it. Some people, that's what I'm saying. Some people, like it's different. Like it's different goals to this rap shit. Like some people. Feel like they want to be celebrities. I know people that really just get stream crazy stream money. A lot of them around people in county twenty four seven. They get real money off music, but they not really celebrities. You know what I'm saying? Some people get they show money like. That's but that's still, still being established though. Yeah. Okay. But some people. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But some so people. I'm, some I'm people feel like if you're not rich if you ain't made it. If you're not, you know what I'm saying? No, I'm just saying established. Period. Like if you. So you can be fifty and still rap as long as you established. Right. And you got something Shit, to talk about. Shit, how old is Jay-Z? Right, that's what I'm saying. You got something to talk about. That's easy, it's Jay-Z. But people would look at a regular dude. Right, right. Like I said, as long as you got so something you say it behind you and it's a hobby that man, you, you enjoy doing. Me, you're not going to look at, the, okay, Jay-Z versus a man, you know. Right. Man. On that level or close to that level, you know what I'm saying? I get what he's saying. He's saying local and they ain't media. Because yeah, I know he's going to be like, he needs to sit his ass old ass man. He keep rapping. But what he man, just. I know y'all, y'all, y'all going to carry shit. Exactly. Y'all going to carry shit. What he just said was well, he doing shows and stuff. No, I'm just talking about period. If you 50 something, if you 50 years old. If you. Let me tell you what I'm talking about. There's a cap on it. If you're if you're trying to get into it, you're not doing shows, you're not doing this, that, third, you're not established. Yeah. Let me tell you what the cap is for me. It's a musician, period. So yeah, if I was living, y'all seen like from Hello the Money, they yeah. just right. put music on it. So listen to this though. Okay. It's an age gap for it's a age limit on it when like the father in Brooklyn, he was a musician. Meanwhile, she was a teacher carrying everything on her back. Mm -hmm. Now mind you, he like probably in his forties. Mm -hmm. She carrying all the bills. Everything he because he's still dependent on gigs. And that's what I'm saying. That's when it's the age gap. It's right. like, no, this is what I am. If you, no. you got to let it go. Right. Exactly. I agree with that. If you establish and you have a job and you still.
stable and everything is good, then that can be your hobby. Yeah. You can rap till you fucking can't breathe no more. Right. I don't care, but when it comes to my family, yeah, bro, depending on because yeah. the father and Kirkland was so trying saying, to oh, okay, break. So that you said okay, so you said they depending on the right. He was trying to break. Right. So when 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 it it comes to age gap only when that that's your only income and I'm breaking my back trying to hold us afloat. And the father you got to fall back. They said in the movie that his music wasn't relatable no more. Like he didn't yeah. want to transition to what was current and what was going on. He Same wanted to play Frankie classical Lyman. music. Like. Frankie Lyman. But you can't compare them. Oh. But I'm just saying, yeah, it's a, it's a, <laughs> just, I'm saying <laughs> it becomes a time. Right, right. It's oh, time. Well, it's time to come to the Frankie Lyman. Is. Oh my <laughs> God. It, it becomes watch. an age limit when you can't <laughs> provide because this is all you're depending on. This is your only hustle. Rapping is not, shouldn't be the only one hustle. Well, I was about to ask y'all, but we had to introduce y'all first. So, what? before y'all, he said the people want to hit the crazy shit. So. Uh, before y'all got oh, here, okay, we talking about polygamy. Yeah, we was talking about polygamy. polygamy. Yes, you know what's so crazy? I was really having a conversation with somebody. So, yeah, we, got minutes, we, got you know, we got 14 really, minutes. We got 14 minutes to discuss like, polygamy. All right, this is some real shit. Like, I'm really with it because, you know me, I travel a lot. Mm-hmm. I'm not home a lot. Mm-hmm. You know, females get tired of toys. So wait a minute. So, so you gotta get my girl. Like, no, 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 no. So, no, no, so what? So wait, wait, you get what I'm saying? No, you gotta let me talk. You gotta let me talk. Let me talk. A polygamy race. That's when y'all got like. It could be two wives or two. Yeah, that's what I'm more saying. Than one I'm all but that don't mean they have so, to interact with each other though. I, they could be sister, sister wives that don't necessarily that interact with each other. I thought polygamy is all no. three. Y'all got to be no. equal. No. <laughs> No. <laughs> oh no, this is the honest uh, podcast. I know. Yeah. So wait, like, so wait, wait would you be? Hold on, let me I'll ask you this: see. Would you be with a girl that has? You will be one husband, and she'll have another husband. Too. No, a girl. They gotta be girl. But I'm saying, so you they went. Have to but you don't, have to enga- you don't have to engage. You don't have to engage with the man. I agree with a dude had two girls, but now I agree with a girl. You don't have to engage with the man. This is your woman in your time, and this woman in. I thought polygamy. But see, that's why it's so fucked up because y'all created to be. But still, y'all. Uh, it ain't like it's See? separate. That's just yeah, you having two separate relationships. Well, how you just said it, that's two separate. No, you can be in all like three y'all group. in one. Like it ain't like okay, yeah. That's my girl, and she got a husband over there. No, polygamy is all three no, y'all. I, no, polygamy is just multiple well, relationships. Period. Can so be, you can, can have a, you can have multiple wives. But they're not in a relationship oh, together. Right. Like they could have their own bedrooms, <laughs> but they're not in a relationship together, Man, and they still be considered too much polygamy. money. The polygamy I know See? about is all too much money. money. Yeah, I feel like if, it's too much I, money. I, I feel like if my money girl, money if my girl really, really wanted, like, like if she really wanted a girl, like, like that's what I said. Girl, it would have I'll to be with. somebody rich because I'm not dealing with that. That's a, that's so what he just said is his his girl would really have to want a girl. So like if she really oh you want them in there and get you want that. You I, want I that type it, of situation. Yeah, like, oh, okay. Well, that you works want for one you. relationship. Like, but that's you know your rules. Right, so he want yeah, one relationship. Let me ask you. They try to say you, you can't be, you can't have love, real love with two people. So, look, like, with rapping, do you think you need to have more than one girl being a rapper? No, it ain't got nothing to do with being a rapper. No, I'm just asking. That's my question. Do you no. think you need to have? No. The no, image? No. No. I'm not even the type. Like, if my shorty wanted a girl, then I'm with it. So that's the only time you achieve your shorty want a girl. That's not cheating. Oh, my shorty, but she agrees to try to get a big knock. It's real. What you mean? I mean, yeah, it's serious. Like, they want oh, we so do y'all agree with it? No, no, we don't. <laughs> it's not for me. We don't. Uh, I would do it. It's not for me. I would have to be in control. I, like I said before, y'all wasn't here earlier. We I feel like it's fine. You got to be dominant over the male? Yeah, well. Yeah, just know I have her show, so I make the schedule. Man, she act like she, you. No, you be and no I'm about saying, no, I don't say, I don't say, I said all this to be, I said, I would not, I'm not saying I would do it, but I'm saying I could do it, like mm-hmm. it's not something, but it wouldn't be somebody I already love. It would be, love. Girl, it would be two girls. No, it would be a husband. Oh, see, nah. So, yeah, 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 and yeah. I would deal with y'all on different days. Yeah, when that person and you want girls, you want to live with me. And I would deal with y'all on different days. Whenever, and you no, won't live with me either. Ask her how she's doing. 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 Ask her how she's 
So like what, what do you mean? Them, what do they do? Give because me some guys act like females. So what is it that uh, you're yeah, talking about? I don't about? care how I act. I mean, I'm just, so right. I don't know what you're talking about. So what are you I saying? I don't know. I just hate when females be trying to be niggas. Like, I hate when the people have no, like, they don't even know how to not no home train or they all need to want to do everything. Niggas do talk like niggas. I just hate that shit. Like, a lot of females just don't be females. What's talk like this? Like, and what is don't be females though? That's what I'm trying to say. Alright, I hate females to be not saying real. Like men, like rest of all, we trying to fight or always trying to, you know what I mean? Get mm-hmm. some drama and shit. Like, I don't like females like that. Mm-hmm. I like a bit. Of course, if it come down, you know what I'm saying? Tell yourself whatever. But I hate when females real drama porn and real drama porn. A lot of these girls move and they be talking like they got real beef with niggas and shit. Like, uh, nah. beef with bitches and shit. Like, I hate I when females, I hate when females act like they don't care and they really do. That's not what I do. Okay. I do, I, so I don't want y'all to think that y'all Ashley just sat there and said, well, I don't act what so what I don't. Well, well, no, we talking to me and say, the question you asked, yeah, well, I know that, but now I'm saying, 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 saying he don't like women who act like they don't care, and I'm like, I don't want him to think I'm that type of woman. Yeah, why is that? Because female be trying to Let me tell you, I know when to care, and I know when not to care. But let me say, everybody don't get care. How do y'all know when she's acting like she don't care versus when she cares? She really don't care. She really don't give a fuck. You don't always care. Yeah, how do you no, know when they care. doesn't care? How do you know? Cause y'all let a nigga know when y'all do care. Behind closed doors. Mm-hmm. So I give me, like but give me an example talking, though. Like when females start uh, start speaking mm-hmm. on they and they especially like say for instance, if my girl always on it, always that, always speak on this, speak on that. But when I'm doing yeah. the same thing, yeah. and she, when I'm doing the same behavior, and she ain't even kicking, and she ain't even talking, she ain't even tripping, and I know she probably gonna tired. So oh, you you talking about when she stopped caring. We talking about females who really don't care. Really like, like, what she I doing and don't like, like, like I got a homeboy like, like, why do you say she cares but she really don't care? Though. I got a perfect example. I got a homeboy, like she right? She care for your well-being. And he had, he had flew a girl out. And, and and he was telling me and shit, all the shit they was doing and shit. But he was, no, I mean, the girl was, he, the girl knew he had a girl. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, no, I mean, it was, damn, how the fuck can I explain it? Hurt. What it, what it, what it, what it. All right, she knew she knew he had a girl, and then when she got back to the crib, it was like, "Fuck you," know what I mean? But the whole time you knew had I had a girl, yeah. Yeah. But it's just like you just you just cared it like you ain't care. But but the problem is, girls try to make stuff more than what it is. Okay, you go into a situation, you already know what it is. If he got a girlfriend, you already know what it is. Don't do too much. He got a girl, you don't have to do nothing. He got a girl. Right. You see what I'm saying? Like, that's the problem. They try to make it more than what it is. Right. And that's, that fuck them is a backfire for them. Don't, right, don't yeah. fuck uh, with a nigga with a bitch if you can't fuck with a nigga with a bitch. Right. And then if, if he's gay and he got a female, then you already know what's coming with it. So you know what you found out for, so you can't get But let me, let me play devil's advocate, though, because a lot of females will go into something. Each other. That's a a lot of females will go into a situation knowing how it is and thinking they're going to be treated a certain way. And yeah. then the nigga confuse them by treating them like, like a girlfriend or like whatever. So they'll think that the nigga feel a different way than the nigga really do. I don't do. Well, how do you treat that? No, 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 females no, no, they, I'm saying niggas don't stick to the script either no. when it comes no, they to don't. Some shit. They don't. Oh. That make everybody feel equal. No, like you know, yeah, so they can, we so they can have had. I don't blame you. Yeah, no, 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 I don't blame you. No, 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 they may go into it knowing what it is, but then the nigga don't want them to date nobody else. The nigga don't want Man, them to date nobody else. the girls be knowing the and they be thinking them. they be they be thinking they gonna be all right. Then they get right. But I'm nigga. telling you why. Yeah, you gotta be confident. I'm telling you why. Look, no, listen, no, listen, like I know, like real shit, bitches are. I didn't know. I didn't know. I can speak on my experience. I didn't been experienced with bitches. Tell me, like, all right, look, you know, I don't want to date nobody else. Like, 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 I don't want to date nobody else. Do this, I don't do this, I got this, don't catch feelings, I don't got time, but I'm like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Next thing you know, you on it, you know what I'm saying? Why you, you know what I'm saying? Now your feelings, you the one who told me that. Yeah, they was right. A lot of females be, nah, they don't even be fronting, but they it be no, taking they that one nigga and catch them off guard. You know what I'm saying? I'm they not saying that's false, but I'm just saying a lot of females. Hey, look, can I ask you a question? 
Hey, look, I, I, I treat every you girl You make everybody same special. Girl. You make no, everybody feel special. No, I don't. Okay. You don't? Okay. Oh, you, oh. And they just talk about it. Everybody listen, they know me. You know what I mean? So, they're talking about your type. I'm talking about the niggas who go into it and they just be like, I'm going to do it. Oh, I'm going to do it. Telling the bitch like I got a girl, oh, so yeah, yeah. she expecting for you to treat her like a side bitch, and then you end up treating her like a girlfriend. But so it's then not even you treat her like a girlfriend, just like some niggas. It is. Right, hold on, I know, good. but some let me let me no, right. treat her like a girlfriend if let she me. can't do what she want to do. She can't go nowhere. She right. can't do this. Who like she can't be smart enough. Who the hell can't be smart enough? 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 Who the hell can't be you gotta have control of your side bitch so you she don't fuck to. up your real But no, but what she mean by control, it be niggas Not that, that high. control she talking about though, like, how you, about what you, control you talking about? They get jealous. They get jealous. Oh, no, one I'm telling you, why would I ever get jealous oh, when it's Because they do. When a girl that's not my girl. Because they don't need niggas that, okay, what's going on with that shit? A nigga got a bitch, okay, and you go in there and, okay, all right, we just, you know, we we cool, we hanging out, we doing, we doing. But then, the nigga could be like, and you out with your friend because you, you got a friend too. You got a nigga. And then he all sad or he like, no, he snapping or he crying or he coming to your house but doing shit happens. like that because. It don't happen. But what I'm saying is, you got a line. He got a line. He got a line. He got a line. And if you know you got some yeah, shit yeah, going yeah, on, yeah. don't bother me. When yeah, I'm out and I'm doing me, I give you the same respect that I need. Right. Don't fuck with me, I'm not gonna fuck with you. But when well, you fuck you know with me, happened. then I'm gonna fuck with you. And that's what I'm saying. The niggas so, do me fucking with you. Yeah. And look, 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 yeah, look. Look, 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 Y'all guess a hard time guess and run around. Then when a nigga knock y'all noodle loose and fuck you good, y'all just so accessible. But when we get y'all to run around, that's a problem. Um, you not gonna give me no running around. around. I don't know. All I right, yeah, because I ain't running around behind. I can't believe you. I'm you fucked up. No, I can't believe so, 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 so y'all never, y'all snatch it. So y'all never, y'all never, hold on, 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 now that, it, that y'all get him to run around, he doing the same thing with you when y'all accessible. Now you like, why the fuck you doing this to me? Like, like why the thing you were doing to him, and he doing it to you now. Why y'all get mad about it? Don't tell me y'all never been. 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 You can't do what you don't, 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 it, it ain't that, but it ain't that way. You can't feel no tight way. But why do you give a damn? I don't give a damn. It's not even. Ain't that thing good? Now you got that chase. I may say to my bitch, what the fuck wrong with him? But I don't give a damn. That don't yeah, mean if I you care. say that, if you say that to your, if you say that to your friend, if you say that to your friend, you care. Yeah, you no, 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 you wouldn't bring no, it up. No. But you, you wouldn't bring it up. It's just something girl to talk about. about. Girl, I don't man. give a damn. There's a million things in the world I'm to talk about. Hold on, hold on, nigga. But the delivery ain't gonna be like that. It's gonna be like, all right, this nigga, this nigga, think he's slick. That's what it's gonna be. Damn, thank you, slick. Damn, we come back for real. Watch me dog relate to this because I'm always in a relationship. Like right. I don't go, yeah. like I don't go through that. Like I'm always in a relationship. Like I never <laughs> like I'm dead serious. Like, like so when I say I can't relate, I'm dead serious. Well Both she can't relate. I can't relate. And let me tell you this. But that's good to me. It's some niggas it's a, it, it may be a nigga I give a fuck about but I ain't seen him in a long time. Okay. Okay. And hey, it's, it's, it's just <laughs> that's because y'all really don't care. We ain't got nothing. But she not gonna do. ever display that oh, to that really? nigga though. Oh, so he still ain't gonna know she give a fuck or not. No, I got. I mean, it's, it's, it's one nigga I do love. God damn. It is one nigga I do love. I'm what about? I mean, well, you always got, about you always got that one nigga that you love. I'm talking about if you experience somebody that has done that, the nigga not. What Tay just said, the nigga not gonna. What do you do? Knock your noodles loose and then how you and chase then be on the run. Like, yeah, and he got but, it ain't, but it ain't necessarily chasing. It's just now that, now that, the now I mean, you more accessible hey, to we him. Got one minute first. Hit, huh? We got all the minutes. 
I'm sorry. You get what I'm saying? It, it's not even chasing. It's just that. It's just that now that you don't let him. No, the table's I mean, turned. Fuck, the table's turned. Now you more accessible to him. But he really could be busy this, that, and the third. Now you feeling like he getting you to run around. And that's the same shit. Because that wasn't the name. energy he was given at first. And, and that's well, the energy you gave at first. So that's what I'm saying. it, it sounds like men energy. do that on purpose. You know, no, 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 it don't. Why would it And then act like men do that. Man, no, it don't. You know what? It's different. Once you drop it off the lap. And now, and now, and bitch, I ain't in the lap. Oh, what is oh. it? It's just, just like, you know what I'm if you're not shit. that, just like the car, if it ain't the car that you really fuck with, man, it ain't that <laughs> bitch, you know what I'm saying? MG, it's just a ceiling. It ain't MG. So after you drop it off the line, it ain't the same. And that's how a lot of y'all niggas are. A lot of y'all don't want to get yeah. with y'all. Then I yeah. want the hell cat. I ain't never had no scat pad. What you mean? But I'm saying that's a lot of y'all niggas. Y'all are the scat pad. And then I mm-hmm. want the hell cat. So when I... See that you ain't really the real thing. They both are. Exactly. <laughs> why, why can't you? But why can't you have a scat? They both go too hard. Nah, it's nothing wrong with a scat pack. I'm just you wanted to use but that. So I, I don't know nothing about no cause. I don't know. Alright, well, y'all talking about? So y'all, we have we have like three minutes left. You should have told him the same reason why he don't got no Apple Watch on. That's why you can't have no damn scat pack. Who got the Apple Watch on? So she saying he doesn't. He don't. Okay, so. Oh. Okay, so, I, and nothing wrong with Apple Watches. If y'all guys watching, y'all have Apple no, Watches, you're said. more than welcome to come on the show. No that's Apple not Watch what I was talking about. Oh. Yeah, Girl, no, you you know, know, that's not what I said. That's not what I said. I'm just saying, if somebody got an Apple Watch, they might feel like, you know. Because they're going to flag us for bullying. Oh, God. Well, what? Where the fuck an Apple Watch coming for Anyway, so we wrapping up this last episode. I mean, not this last. We wrapping up this episode of Pretty Exclusive Content. Thank you for tuning in. We got a few more minutes. We had another we got a special guest. Come in real quick. Anybody want to freestyle? He said we got to try. That's freestyle. Hold on. Let me just let y'all. So we, we started from the bottom, and let me tell y'all, they came. I appreciate y'all for coming because we just started. But he said we have to pay him for freestyling, but what? we can't this pay him. Right, cause no, I like that. Get up here. We follow you. You want to route? You want to tell them go to your Instagram, Danny? Cause you know what? I'm sick of them already. I'm sick of them already. All y'all can sit. Let me hear. Let me hear something. We gonna get y'all from the front. I don't want to put y'all on the spot. Right here, camera. So all y'all gonna route? Y'all gonna pass it? We gonna move up with ten? You get my. That's my dog. Uh, but he is the best freestyler I heard. I, I seen him. Get that one more time. I don't think they heard you. Let me say something, y'all. Let me say something. I, I don't the best know freestyler. him. But I like to watch freestyle battles because I feel All like the I, time. I can rap. From so, the Smack DVD. He's really good, y'all. So y'all go follow his page. Tell him y'all your Instagram so they can follow him. Official underscore Ty Pretty underscore music. Some you need the car wash, hit your boy up. You want to do this without music? Or you need music. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, it's time for music. music. How you want me to do it? Whatever you want. Go. Y'all can rock about polygamy today. Rock about polygamy. Let me y'all got to show. Having two, three wives. I forgot what's. I came up with some crazy shit today too, man. You gotta keep it with Don't be careful. That's what I was gonna say. Get that bag. I said, make no mistake. I'm no longer letting my talent go to waste. I tried to give you niggas the space you need for all that make-believe, but who you gonna make believe that shit that you say? You niggas is fake, and we hear it in the music that you make. So we don't listen to that music that you make, but y'all call it hate. Mad because the city won't embrace them lies you disguise and them rhymes you create. Mm-hmm. It's time for a change. I'm tired of the base. Niggas playing like I ain't the greatest. The fuck is y'all saying? Because half the time I ain't even trying. Still, you got to recognize every line is amazing. Mm-hmm. Y'all niggas basic. <laughs> Try me and your pride to get caved in. I dare nigga rise to the occasion. Yeah. Ever since I came in, I've been going ape shit. Spitting ghetto gospel, nigga. Amen. How I'm not your favorite. Please, explain this to me. I've been snapping ever since them crackers set a nigga free. Uh-huh. I tried to relax. But they won't let a nigga be So I told Kenny, let me off the leash I'ma show niggas the real difference Between men and whole niggas yeah. That sell their soul for their record They go gold niggas yeah. I might speak, but I don't know niggas I'm not one of those niggas <laughs> Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm one of those niggas. <laughs> yeah. Exposed niggas, let them see it disguise. And all them little secrets you hide, but we ain't really surprised. I just don't understand why you can't be yourself when that's the best part of being alive. You niggas grew up privileged, wasn't even deprived. You ain't had to hit the streets to survive. And all we wanted was a piece of the pie, but they left niggas with crumbs. And we refused to be victims, so we took our chances with the system. Far as guns go, you had to get one, but y'all criticized like that shit dumb. I guess you're perfect, nigga. You ain't never did none. See, if you want respect, you gotta give some. Yeah. You only live once, and if you're from the hood, son, every day above ground is a good one. By, by next year, I swear, all my blessings shall come, and I'm gonna make all you hating niggas look dumb. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 I told y'all, hold on. See, I told y'all, I don't speak unless I know what I'm talking about. I had an older brother, and let me tell you, I could have been an NR. <laughs> y'all, let me tell y'all, if I ever start rapping, that's gonna be my ghost writer. And he did that. I want to thank, thank y'all for coming, for coming out. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Appreciate y'all. We really do. Come back and see us. This is going to get invited anytime. Y'all can just come and chill and watch us do the podcast and give us some feedback to y'all audience. And thank all y'all for tuning in. Y'all can go to our Instagram. Um, it's pretty exclusive I just content. content. And y'all can go to our YouTube channel. And please like. What you got to do, Sherry? Like, subscribe. Click, Click like, subscribe. <laughs>